Hey, thanks for staying with us on this special edition of the Eyewitness News. I'm Katie Moore. And I'm Cherise Gibson. In recent months, we've been reporting on a string of ATM thefts in the New Orleans area. Yeah. A Louisiana lawmaker says if you commit this crime, you should go to jail. Paul Murphy reports he's proposing a mandatory prison sentence for it. An automatic teller machine smash and grab is not your typical theft or burglary. That's according to State Representative Tony Bacala, a Republican from Prairieville. He's now calling for stiffer penalties for this type of crime. This is more, uh, more like a bank robbery uh, with the amount of money that, that is stolen and the amount of damage is done. Susie Marshall can tell you all about it. In January, she was working at the Tasty Donut at Esplanade Avenue and Broad Street in New Orleans. Suddenly, masked men rammed the pickup truck into the business. They charged in through broken glass and fallen bricks. After trying to pull the machine from the floor and ramming the building a few more times, they left with the ATM. It was stressful because I didn't realize that he had a gun and, you know, we run it for our lives that morning, so you can't, at least we made it out safe. Police believe this crime may be connected to a string of similar thefts, including one at an uptown region's bank and another at a convenience store on Chapatula Street. Bacala's bill calls for a mandatory minimum of five years in prison if convicted of a new state crime, theft of an ATM. And this is like an organized crime uh, issue now. Go somewhere else because you're going to face serious consequences here. And it just really, the, 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 the penalty should fit the crime. Back at Tasty Donut, Marshall says you should go to jail if you steal an ATM. Probably would help them because in that way they'll teach them a lesson. Also, they probably learn from what they've done. So that would be a good thing for them. Because of the trauma employees endured and the damage done, this Tasty Donut decided not to replace their stolen ATM. Police are still looking for suspects. Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News. Under Bacala's bill, in addition to going to jail, whoever commits an ATM theft would also have to pay a fine equal to the amount of money in the machine when it was stolen. The proposal is expected to be considered by lawmakers during the upcoming session of the legislature, which begins next month.